Hello everybody, my name is Katrina and today I will be reacting to more of BAP. So it's been quite a while since I've reacted to some of their stuff and then it's been even longer since I've reacted to some of their music. Um, I'm still working on like how to maintain certain things for making videos. Um, but I'm here with them today. I'm going to be watching three more of their music videos slash songs. Um, so what I'm going to be watching today is their music video for Hands Up, Young, Wild, and Free. And then the last one, um, I have, it's like the same thing but in two videos. So... Uh, apparently they had a song called Goodbye, and then they had, like, an animation t to it. Um, so when I went on, like, their site and their official stuff, um, I saw the, like, animated one, well, Matoki, I don't know if I'm saying that right, but their characters. But I saw that it was only, like, 49 seconds, so I wasn't fully sure if that's the correct one because that doesn't seem like it would be the full song um but then i saw another one that looks like it might be it might have been posted by a, a fan or um something like that um that's four minutes um and it's like the same characters in the animation so i don't know if that one's right i don't know if the uh, one on their official page is right so i figured why not just do both of them so I have both of them uh, ready and that I can get the full um, idea of the song uh, and the animation with it. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited. Um, so I know I did do a guide to them, but I can be quite slow with names, with faces. So sometimes certain people just click, and then sometimes it takes me forever to remember people's names. So I probably won't be as good um, in this video, but I'm definitely going to be working on getting better to with their names and faces. Um, but I'm really excited. Um, they've had amazing music videos and just amazing music um, from what I've heard so far. Um, so I have good expectations for these songs. Um, so yeah, so the first one I'm reacting to is Hands Up. Awesome. Let's get started. Rising, you're rising. 
몰래 진짜 답은 없네 애초에 문제 따윈 없어 쓰니 놀 거니 똑바로 봐 Let's look around 전부 같이 사고 방식들을 벗어나 우리 죽이는 변혁 반 생각과 실성과 우레 비친 진짜 너에게 해서 별빛 하나 없이 불이 꺼진 밤이 어둡다는 이유로 그 자리에 멈춰 설순 없어 가졌던 너를 깨워 expecting that sound you know what I think I think where this got me is when I first heard be it like that they had a song called hands up I think I instinctually thought of I'm pretty sure it was block B I think they had a song called hands up um, I, I, I'm pretty sure it's them um, so I naturally thought like that kind of vibe and it was not that like this was a bit more of an intense block B was a bit more like fun like that kind of thing so it threw me off at the beginning entirely um, but the beat in this was really good um, they're dancing also like they were there was like one part they were really like they they were like together really well um, I also love the addition of like the background dancers. I don't remember seeing background dancers in like any of their other songs. Um, but I think it's actually a good addition because it gives, it still gives that, like it gives that intense um, dance factor to it but still brings attention to the members because of how like they decided to dress everyone. Um, but it was really good. Um, I feel like this has like deeper meaning to it. Um, I don't, I don't necessarily, I'm not necessarily fully sure what it is. I'm not always great at guess, like thinking of what the meaning of a song is necessarily when I listen to it for the first time. Um, it takes me a bit before, um, but this definitely seems like it had intense meaning to it, which if it does, that's awesome because I think when songs have great lyrics, it just makes the song even better. Um, but I really like this. I think they are so, okay, so I've probably said it in my other videos, their dancing good, their singing's good, their rapping's good they're they're just consistently good um and i think i feel like they surprise me every time yet i really shouldn't be surprised by them um because they they've been consistent i think the storyline is always the part that just I, like i'm surprised with because of how, like how movie like they are um but i really like this one this 
I feel like this has the potential to be one of my favorites. Um, I think I liked it because it was a very active beat, yet it was quite simple. It was a very similar, like, sound in the instruments, like, throughout the whole thing. And I loved when... I love when they get to, like, the bridge portion of the song and they kind of get rid of all of that, allow the vocals to shine a bit more, and then bring it back. Um, I know that's what most bridges do, but going to such an extreme of getting rid of all of it is how I mean it. Um, and I know I've, I've brought him up before, because I, I think, yeah, here. His rap, I really should have, I feel like it's been too long since I reacted to them, so like, I'm not thinking of their names properly. So I should have done, I, I, I need, I'm going to be getting, I'm, well, hopefully I'm going to get better at, like, looking things up before I actually watch a video. Um, but I know I've mentioned this guy in my other videos, um, and I know I, I really like him. His, he's got such an intense, deep voice, but it, it's got so much substance to it that it's, really nice to hear but I think I loved when he came in because it was very simple it was almost as if he was just talking to you he wasn't going hardcore when he started rapping um it was simple it was like he was just talking directly to you you needed to listen to him you need to focus on him um and he got my attention it sounded amazing and his voice is so deep. I know, like, I know there are a lot of, like, rappers in K-pop that have, like, the deep voice, like, and I, 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 so when I have, I have, I've noticed that in the past when finding, like, a bias in a group, there were always, like, two, like, categories or not categories, that's two, but there were always two types, there we go, two types of people I end up kind of going for. And I was always like the somewhat taller, deep voice rapper, or the smaller, soulful rapper, it's not rapper, <sighs> the smaller, soulful singer. That's why I like EXO, it's Dio, um, Big Bang, it's Taeyong, um, and then... Treasure, it for me is Haruto. Um, Seventeen, Woozy, even though Hoshi is also there. But like, so I've had a, I've kind of had a somewhat of a pattern, um, and I feel like he might end up being my bias in this because I feel like I've mentioned him almost every single song, but him in this particularly was amazing, and he looks so freaking cool. He just, he just oozes coolness, I think. But I really liked the song. It was really good. Um, once I realized I wasn't listening to Block B's Hands Up, that's when I kind of dove in a bit more. But it was really good. Um, I really liked it. So the next song I'll be watching is Young, Wild, and Free. All right, cool. Let's get started.
바닥을 껴도 난 일어나 젊은 날 인생은 딱한 번뿐이니까 무작정 앞만 보고 계속 뛰어봐 우리 위험하게 피어날리 정준을 볼 때워봐 내가 최고라고 외쳐 my way the h a w a y No pain no gain 뒤를 떠난 고통이라 카페 다시 일어날 시간 너의 발걸음을 멈추지 마 was a me honestly i love a lot of their songs like and i've i've mentioned that in each but i i think this actually might be contender to be my favorite song from them which is impressive because i've like all their other songs i've heard it's been just amazing so dang i love this one the sound is is was brilliant um The only potential negative I'd be able to see with this song is like I can see people saying that the chorus might be repetitive but I actually didn't quite see it like that. With this it was repetitive but the intensity with the vocals and I, I think there was like the chorus I, I, th I feel like I rem each time I heard it there was something just slightly different um, about it and it was amazing this song was so good I loved the music video the music video looked amazing and the whole beginning before the song like truly started like all this uh, this should work. okay let me get it so it's too beautiful. like all this and them coming in but then like wearing like black and white and it's shining uh, this looks gorgeous and some might say it's too dark you can't really see them but I think that's the point I guess that ignore that comment but they looked so cool it's almost as if like they're not even fully human here like because you've got the eyes like pitted out the all black and whatnot and it just looks so cool but then it's as if oh It's, it's as if they're like coming to and coming in their own way and it's so cool. I love how they're doing it in a way that it's like black and white kind of-esque based off of the lighting and the surroundings. Looks amazing. And then there was a flash at one point. Oh, it was... It, oh, no. Oh, oh, I didn't do that right. I didn't do that well. Okay. I don't know where it was. But there was like a flash where it was like a red light kind of flash for a second which then incorporated it to going to them all being in red like ugh, looks the visuals in this were so amazing and it was so cool I don't 
get the mouth kind of going backwards. I don't know what that necessarily means, but it looks awesome. Um, their outfit choices in this were amazing. I loved it. Like every single outfit that they were wearing kind of like looked cool. They looked awesome. Um, ooh, I'm going to go to the end for a second. I love this shot because when I see this, I see the ending of Fantastic Baby and Big Bang sitting in all their chairs and then you can see different characteristics among all of them uh, with it. I think it looks so freaking cool. Um, I'm curious what the lion with the wings and the shield is supposed to represent because um, it definitely seems as if they're fighting something. Um, but love the shot, um, the guitar throughout the song, and especially at the beginning when it was first introduced, sounded amazing. I love when you can actually hear the instruments in the songs, and like they they get to almost have their own shining points, um, because. I love how, where we've gone with music and how we've changed things over time and whatnot. I think it's amazing, but I, I always, I've, I've like played instruments since I was a little kid. Um, and I, I just love hearing like true instruments in the song and hearing them pop out and shine at different moments. Um, it's almost as if they're a character of their own. And I, I love when songs do that, and I feel like this kind of did that, um, which I loved. And I, I loved how they kind of went from black and white going through the colors, like when they were throwing the color at each other. Oh, that was... A, that was a... Okay, that wasn't... Okay, here, here's a better shot. Like, this looks so freaking cool. And it's, it's awesome because when you really think about it, sometimes it's the simplest type shots that make the best looking shots. Um, and I, I like it because like here they, it's as if they're playing with uh, the elements again like they did in some of their earlier um, songs, which I think is so cool. But this is such a simple shot, yet they executed it so well, and then it, so it makes it look so, like, just so cool. It's, it's really just a blacked out environment with some, like, bright, it looks like probably white or blue toned lights shining down, and then them throwing the colors, and, and it looks amazing. It's, it was done so well. Um, they all sounded amazing. Like when they went into the bridge here of this song, I don't know where it is, but those harmonies and the high notes, like I, it sounded like two people were harmonizing with each other and they were both like quite high and it sounded amazing. They sounded gorgeous. Um, and then there's another like person in here. I don't, I don't think I realized it in the other ones or past videos, but there's another person with quite a deep voice that's not the rapper that I mentioned in the last one. Um, it's impressive. Uh, I don't think I've heard him like that before, but I also can't fully think of all the different aspects of the songs I've listened to so far. Um, but he sounded really great. Like, well, they all sounded really good. Um, I am curious about what the story is because at one point it looked like the person pulled off the sheet and it was them dead. Like, on on a table not a table but like a table basically um so i'm curious what that means um but i really like this song it sounded so good i yeah this is definitely a contender for one of my favorite songs for sure okay cool you know i'm just gonna do a quick look through see if there was like anything else i wanted to point out um, I think, I think I got my main points. Um, yeah, okay. So the next one, 
I'll be watching is Goodbye with the Matoki. I'm pro I I I feel like I might be saying that wrong, so if I am, please uh, feel free to correct me politely in the comments. Um, but this is the one that was actually on the uh, the it's the company's uh, just YouTube. Sorry, I can think. Um, so it's the forty nine second one. Um, so, like I said earlier, I don't know if this is the right one or the one I'm going to watch next is the right one, but I'm just doing both as a just-in-case. Um, but cool. Uh, let's get started. Goodbye, goodbye, this world will be alive. That seems... So I don't know, I don't remember who's who. I know each member has their own character and I'm pretty sure they have. They all have different looks spe specified for um, their character. I, so I don't know which member is represented as who. Um, this seems like it's going to be one of those songs that it's very upbeat song yet gonna be quite depressing not in a bad way but like because it's it definitely seems like it's their goodbye song to the fans i don't know if that's the case because when i look at the time this was uploaded it seems like it was uploaded before young wild and free which i think this says 10 years and the, uh, the other one said like seven so i don't know if it's that um so if it is, that seemed, it sounded good. Like, the drums sounded awesome. The vocals were impressive. No surprise there. But I loved the instrumental of this. Um, but I feel like it might be one of those kind of sad songs. Um, so yeah, the, it, their characters look cool. I, I, I didn't have much to go off of in that, but... It seems like I, I, well, I'll start the next one, the, it's, so the next one's, it's like four minutes long, so I'll watch that, um, and see if that's the whole thing, but, yeah, I'm looking forward to, I think this has the whole song in it, so I'm looking forward to that, but, yeah, let's get started. <laughs> Sorry, I'm pausing the song. Okay, so it looked like the animation I saw in the last one is going to be what's only in this and it's going to repeat for the entire time. Um, so I'm just going to focus on the song and not as much the video because I don't fully know like who's who. Um, so if you let me know that, um, 
in the comments, I would greatly appreciate it. But song-wise, I'm enjoying it for, so far, so sorry for pausing. good um gonna be honest i said i wouldn't watch watch it but i of course got distracted by um the animation it was the same through and through but i kept focusing on that a bit but the i said i said it when i paused but the drums in this sounded amazing um um i think it got me like the bridge got like the bridge of songs usually is the part that gets me a bit more hooked um, I loved that they got rid of all the music and then brought it back even more intense after. Um, I'll definitely have to listen to this song again, though. Um, probably also read the lyrics, because I feel like for this song, the lyrics would be important. Um, which I probably should have just put on so that I could read them while doing this, but... A little too late for that now. Um... But I definitely want to know what the song's about, because it definitely, it's called Goodbye, so they're obviously saying goodbye to something. Um, so I don't know if that's necessarily to each other, to the fans, um, or just to them, their younger selves kinds of things, like they're coming into a new, um, I don't know what it is. I feel like it's a bit, it's definitely an emotional um, song. Um, so I love that they made it kind of upbeat, but there was still an intensity and an emotion in the instrumental um, that kind of stuck with what I was, what I generally was thinking the songs about. Um, I can't say like lyrically what I thought they were saying, just because I didn't really have much to go off of. 
um, but they sounded great. It sounded good. Um, I, I can't give you my full opinion about the song just because I was kind of getting a bit distracted. Um, but I think it, from what I hear, heard, it sounded really good. Um, so I'll definitely listen to that again. Um, the animation, I'm, I think it's really cute. I love the animation. Um, I don't fully understand what it's trying to say, but that might also be because I don't know necessarily what was happening at this time and like who's who. Um, so please feel free to let me know that information in the comments. I would greatly appreciate that. Um, but they're impressive. They, they've always been impressive. Um, and they, I'm not remembering like any of their stuff right now. Like, and it's making me kind of sad. Um, but I like them. I definitely do want to do more of their stuff. Um, I'm trying to do a bunch of different groups, so unfortunately sometimes certain groups get spaced out a bit more, um, but I definitely do plan on making sure that the groups I like that are on my channel, I get to, so that's why I'm doing this and I'm going to do more of them in the future because I do, I do genuinely like this group. Um, I've always found them, like, very impressive. Um, but yeah, I enjoyed all the songs today. I definitely think Young, Wild, and Free is my favorite out of the ones I listened to today. It was just, it was so cool. It just, everything about it just stood out to me. And I, I so I really enjoyed it. I enjoyed all of them, but that one just a little bit above the other ones. Um, but yeah, I, I enjoyed watching these. Um, if you, ooh, Sorry, I lost my train of thought. That happens way more often than I'd like to admit. But if you have any recommendations for this group, for other groups, um, I I think I remember someone in the comments telling me that they they have solo careers or they're doing solo stuff now. So if they, they have any solos that you'd like me to listen to, please feel free to leave those in the comments also. Um, I love getting recommendations because it gives me songs I wouldn't have necessarily thought of watching, reacting to, um, and I started this channel to grow my K-pop knowledge and the different songs I listen to, so if you do have any recommendations for anything K-pop related, please feel free to leave them in the comments below. Um, and that'll be it for today's reaction. Um, I hope you enjoyed um, today's video, and I'll see you all next time. Bye!